Chan Chong here and today I'm gonna to be showing you guys my gaming setup video now as you may or may not know I moved from Perth to Sydney uh, Maybe like three months ago, and I finally got around to doing a gaming setup video So this is my gaming setup behind me you see it in videos But I'm gonna go full in depth and show you guys what it's like So if you do end up enjoying it, please smack that like button real good and now Let's jump to the gaming setup. All right, so when you walk in, this is pretty much what you see. You see my editing station, you see my magic station, and you see my PlayStation, or, well, game station. That's, that's a PlayStation. But anyway, uh, let's, 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 where should we begin this video? I'm thinking over here. Let, let's go with the simple stuff. So, as you can see here, this is my little stool. I actually don't sit on this one. I do edit my videos. Uh, that's for recording videos. That's why you never see the back of my computer chair in videos because I actually sit on a stool when I actually record my videos. But here is the thing. This is my iMac 27 inch 4K. No, it's got a 5K screen on it. It's crazy. Um, back there, that is a little ghost from uh, Pac-Man and you can change all the colors and everything. And whoa, that's just really bright. Goku's here. Uh, little, ooh, little iTunes card. I'm going to get to that in a moment. But yeah, that's where I edit all my videos. and. Under there, you can see my balls. They're pretty big. Anyway, moving on. Um, we're gonna skip the bed because hell, it's just a bed. Okay, now I haven't skipped it. I'm technically talking about it, so now it's a little awkward. But anyway, let's move on to this. You guys have seen it in quite a lot of my videos, and I will show you guys in depth with what I have on the desk, what I have on that shelf, and what I have on this shelf, or the technically multiple shelves. Right at the top, we have the Boombox from NBA 2K. We have this beauty right here. That is my YouTube plaque where I should focus that better. There we go. And then right here we have the camera that I've used in thousands of videos or hundreds of videos. I'm not sure, but it, it put in a lot of work. It eventually did die uh, about six months ago. I had to get a new one, which is what I'm recording on right now with. Um, but yeah, that thing gave me a lot of good service. Moving on, this is my WWE World Heavyweight Championship Stone Cold Edition one. Smoking Skull Edition, I think it's technically called. And then behind it, you can see that I do have the little uh, pop vinyl of Stone Cold. So yeah, it's a little Easter egg behind there. Moving down here, we have the vinyl player. And I actually do have some other records like that in there. I got some, wait, I got some Iggy Pop down there. Yeah, I got some good stuff. I got some good stuff. But yeah, that thing is awesome. Another thing that's awesome is my PS4 Pro. I actually hardly use it right now because I've been playing a lot of PC games. So I feel really bad that I haven't used it, but that thing is amazing. And another thing that is amazing is my setup, but I'll get to that in a second. I'll get to that because we are going over here. That is my Xbox One. Uh, that's the Halo edition, I believe. And um, yeah, it, it's got a terabyte of space on it, which is really nice to have when you download a lot of games rather than having it on disc. And even on disc, you still have to have a lot of space. Um, if you're wondering what this white box is, um, this, I don't know what this is. No, it's a DJI Spark. This thing is amazing. Um, even though I haven't technically opened my one, I have used one. I used one when DJI were in Australia and I haven't actually opened this. So if any of you guys have any good suggestions as to what kind of videos I should shoot with this in Sydney, unfortunately I can't do anything at the harbor. Yeah, put a comment in the description down below and uh, you can win that iTunes card that I showed off at the start of the video, like at my editing station. So I think it's like 20 bucks on it. So yeah, if you guys want, let me know what I should do with the DJI Spark. So I'll put that there. Moving on and we have my little shelf of retro Nintendo. It's all Mario themed pretty much. Got Mario 64 there. We have a 64 and the controller and then we also have Mario himself. But what we have up here is my little Ubisoft area. I don't know, I didn't really plan this, but I was like, hey, I've got a lot of Ubisoft stuff. You got Watch Dogs 2 at the back. You got Assassins and Assassins. And then up here, it's just a random station. That's Max Payne from one of the Max Payne games that were out a few years ago. I can't remember what it was called, which number it was or anything. There's been so many Max Payne games. But anyway, this is a Logan limited edition claw. And I think it's number 271 out of a thousand, which is really cool to have. And then finally up on the top of the shelf, we have a limited edition NBA 2K17 ball, which is number 27 of 170, even more rare, which is pretty cool to have. But now we have this section right here and it is my gaming setup. Down here we have my machine that makes it all happen. It is my Omen PC, it's the Omen X. And uh, if you wanna see the specs, I have put them in the description down below because I cannot run through all their specs. I know it has like 32 gigs of RAM. It has, what else is there? Two 1080s in there, so two GTX 1080s. It's, 
It's pretty insane. Specs are in the description down below. But what we also have is the three monitors, which are also HP, and they are 4K monitors, and they are incredible. Um, I will be honest though, I usually have this one turned off because I don't need three monitors. I just happen to have three monitors I'm lucky enough to have. So yeah, I usually have that off. I never really run all three. But yeah, when I'm behind these monitors, I'm usually sitting on this chair. Uh, AK Racing were awesome enough to send me a new chair when I did move to Sydney. So shout out to those guys. I'm not being paid or anything to say that. None of this is like being paid to or anything, but um, yeah, so AK Racing were just legends. They sent me a chair. I wanted something really simple. You can get a green, you can get blues, you can get pink, red, whatever color you want. I picked the gray and the white. It just, it just looks nice and it is a really comfortable chair, especially when I'm sitting behind this for hours and hours each day. King off sitting, oh, there we go. I'm gonna sit down and show you guys what it's like to be behind here. As you can see, I also have my Rode mic. I think it's the NT1A. I'm not too sure anymore, but it, it's like this, so I can just talk to it like, woo! Or I just put it to the side when I'm just playing and not recording or doing anything like that. Holy crap, what the hell? I just noticed I have a fidget spinner. And the thing is, it's American themed. I forgot that I had this. And uh, I'm actually going off to America. You can see my luggage over there in like a couple of hours. Right here is my headset. It's also Omen based. Um, yeah, it's an Omen headset. Uh, I think Steel Series technically make this headset. Um, it's pretty good. I really like it. It's comfortable. That's the main thing. To me, a lot of sound is very similar. I'm not too picky with it. Here is my um, controllers for the Xbox One. And then over, I actually plug one of these in for Rocket League. I think it's this one, not that one. But um, over here, it is my uh, mixer that runs to my microphone so I can do all that stuff. And there is the camera and the, uh, well, I should say tripod for the camera and the light for my, um, for my videos when I shoot like this, you know, that's what, that's what it's for. I also have a little BB-8 right here and uh, yeah, it, it's pretty cool. It just sits there, stares at me while I um, sit behind here and not really, I shouldn't have done that. Now oh, my video is not going to get ads on it. Damn it. <laughs> anyway, uh, here are my PlayStation 4 controllers. They're pretty sweet. I really like this red one. I got that for Valentine's Day. Thanks to PlayStation Australia. They were like, here you go, have a nice gift. And it's red for love and roses and stuff. I don't know, but that's what they gave me. Um, if we turn around over here, a random thing right there. That's meant to go up there. I've just been way too lazy to do anything with it. Uh, my bathroom's over there. I'm not gonna really get into that because it's just a bloody bathroom. Over there, I have like a light and a little desk and stuff, like a little side table. And behind these windows, or behind these things, there are windows, giant windows. However, I'm not gonna show off my, um, like where I live because I don't want Jake Paul coming over, you know, because yeah. I'm pretty sure you all get that really terrible reference. But anyway, that is pretty much it for the gaming setup video, guys. There we have it, the editing station, the bed, and then we also have the main area where everything goes down. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy that. But just a quick note right here at the end, you probably noticed I have really long ethernet cable which goes all the way upstairs. So yeah, it runs upstairs, and as you can tell, it goes all the way up to the living room. And I'll quickly just go upstairs. And for anyone that likes feet, there you go, there are my feet. And here is my kitchen upstairs. See, I just ran from up there. And basically, yeah, it's pretty simple. Over here is the living room. As you can see, the cable goes over there, and then the modem's back there. But nice little reading chair, couch, and all that. And then the Xbox One S here, which isn't even plugged in. I rarely play games or do anything here, but that's that. And to head back downstairs, all you foot fetish people, and back into my room. So here we are. And yeah, um, there we have it, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy this video. If you did, please smack that like button. Also, let me know what I should film with my drone, because you could win yourself this amazing little thing right here. It's like $20 for the iTunes card. Um, I just had it lying around. I was like, well, they, they can give me some suggestions to what to film with my video. So yeah, um, I'm off to LA, got my luggage, gotta go. See you guys in the next one.